Use this technique to auto expand or dynamically expand your drop down list. Take a look at this. I'm going to use this column E here. Select E3 here. In here, I'm going to use the following formula. Is blank not returns a true if the cell is not blank. Filter function filters the range of D2 to D20 based on is blank being not blank. In short, it returns a fruit name if the criteria are true, otherwise NA. Sort will put in alphabetical order and unique will include distinct values in the drop down list. And hit enter here. Next, you're going to go to cell B2 here. Go to data, data tools, data validation, data validation here. Allow, you're going to change this to list. Under source, you're going to click this button and select this guy here. You're going to put a pound here because this is a dynamic list and it can expand. And then hit enter and hit OK. Now you can see that you have a drop down list. And if you add more fruits here, this thing dynamically increases and hence your drop down increases by itself.